gamer, no, I would not want to do a Royal Rumble quiz. And Braun going with the champion. I'm going with Riley. The following champion versus Riley champion did contest. retain her title in a triple threat elimination. Here at the end of this match. For the total non-stop women's action shed. Making way down to uh she has overall record of four wins and three uh, losses. She is the women's intercontinental champion. She is Riley. Redhead. It sounds like this arena is more than ready to kick this one off. So is social media, Michael. The opening bell hasn't even rung, and yet both these superstars are already trending. Making her way down to uh, the ring. She has over a record of three wins and uh, three uh, losses. She is Jordan Rose. Big time singles matches on deck here. And Byron, what should we expect to see here tonight? Well, given the shape these superstars appear This to is the first tonight, title defense for the Queen of, of Summer. We crowned the inaugural Queen time. and King of Summer last week. And now we are back to the defense throughout the whole summer months. Introducing the challenger from Houston, Texas. She is the women. Man, I wanted to go back out in the pool, and as you can champion, tell from my window out there, Riley it's dark Redhead. because there's storms rolling in. I was in the pool for a few hours, and I was like, I'm gonna go back in the pool. The champion, and after I got done streaming, and then freaking Orleans, storms Louisiana, decided to roll in. She is the total nonstop women's action champion, the queen, Jordan Rose. Don't go anywhere. The bill is ringing. The match is underway in this 1v1 Falls Count Anywhere match. And Jordan Rose right away at the around a drop Riley Redhead, followed by a roundhouse to the upper back. Big old kick to the ribs. Another roundhouse to the chest. Forearm to the upper back. Slap. Riley with the slap to Jordan. Running Bulldog connects. You gotta think both these competitors competed already once today, so you can imagine the, what damage they might have from. Jordan grabs Riley, tosses over the top rope onto the apron, and then brings her back in the ring the hard way. Perhaps none was more gruesome than in elbow two of the jaw. And Riley responds with a forearm to the upper back, neck area, running knee to the back, drops Jordan. Riley grabs Jordan by the hair and slams her into uh, the canvas. Now we got a pin. The ref counts to one, and Jordan kicks out at one. As Byron mentioned, Lesnar's attack on Cena in 2012 was without question gruesome. And furthermore, I don't think I've ever seen John Cena. Riley Hyper extends the back of like Jordan. On that night. Yeah, Lesnar definitely brought it to Cena that night. But what's truly amazing is that John Riley has a scissor headlock of block. And Jordan quickly gets out of it. Big old slap. 
misses with the knife edge chop. Jordan grabs Riley. Side headlock. Snap play to connect. There are no disqualifications. No countouts in this one. Anything Roundhouse to the legal. upper back. Oh, kind of wish it won't storm because on his storm, for some reason, our internet is crap. Wish it would have waited just a little bit longer. <laughs> Riley As grabs Jordan, whips her into the far turnbuckles, runs over, monkey flips her out of the corner. Riley brings Jordan and back up to a vertical base. A Kicks her in the midsection, side headlock, and a brain buster. Riley going to line Jordan up to put this away. If she hits this, it might be over. We might crown a new Queen of Summer. Super kick connects. Jordan's down. However, Jordan's right there by the ropes. We got a one. We got a two. And Riley is your a two belt. And she is now your new queen of a summer. Extreme not to the faint of heart, as you can see in these highlights. That's a woman on a mission. And here's the last look at this one. Here is your winner and new total nonstop women's action champion, Riley Redhead. Sending a message to the entire line. Yes, you are still above 15,000, brought it, but you got to take consideration. When the season starts over, it resets. That was exactly what we expected when the match was announced for SummerSlam. What an incredible effort all around. All right, now it's time for our King of Summer. Holy crap, the rain's coming down now. That means internet's going to be crap. All right, we got AJ Anderson, the former Intercontinental Champion, going up against the King of Summer, Jacob Ace. And bets are live. Place for estimation bet space zero for AJ or one for Jacob. Bob and Earth space minus from one to a thousand jokers. This is a title match, so all bets are doubled. Jacob Ace is our first ever seasonal champion from the developmental brand. We have never had a seasonal champion on developmental brand. And he's the first ever. He's looking to go head to head against AJ who is a former men's intercontinental champion. I think AJ's hungry. Jacob obviously is fresh. He hasn't had a, he didn't have a match today. AJ's not. But I, I have a feeling AJ's going to walk hungry for that title. He wants to get one title. Making his way down to uh, the ring. He has over a record of five wins, five losses, and a draw. He is the former men's intercontinental champion. He is AJ Anderson. Excuse him wearing that title. I did not go in and change it outside of the universe. He's not the intercontinental champion. <laughs> Making his way to the ring from Kentucky, weighing in at 220 pounds, the Intercontinental Champion, AJ Anderson. Man, it's 
is pouring. Holy moly. And for me, it'll be interesting to see. As you can tell, it got super any, dark here. The title is not on the line tonight. I don't know, Michael. Part of me thinks he'll fight this fight just like it was any other, regardless of what's at stake. Making his way down to uh, the ring. Has over a record of five wins and six losses. He is the king of summer. He is Jacob. Hey, thank you, T-Box Ring Ghost for the auto host. Weighing in at 275 pounds, the total nonstop men's action champion, Jacob Ace. Both Brada and I are both going for AJ Anderson. Byron, is there a chance he gives less than 100% here tonight, given the fact that the title is not up for grabs? Well, if he does, I can tell you that he's going to get embarrassed here. Title match or not, you simply cannot give less than 100% each time. Just like I expected, as soon as the rain starts and the wind picks up, the internet goes to crap. <laughs> All right, the bell's ring. The match is underway, and AJ with the step-up drop kick to Jacob. Drops him for him to the upper back. Jacob gets right back up to his feet. Grabs AJ. Big old knee to the chest. Never get tired of watching these guys compete. Jacob grabs AJ. Swipes leg up from underneath him. Jacob grabs AJ. Drops his knee into the back of the knee of AJ. Jacob brings AJ back up fireman's to a vertical carry. base, this puts him up in the fireman's carry, Couldn't agree more, Cole. This has and hangs him up on that top rope. AJ fights back with a quick right jab to the lower abdomen. AJ grabs, no, Jacob reverses another quick right jab. AJ grabs Jacob, swing and neck breaker connects. The better chance they have a victory. Forearm to the upper back. Swing and neck breaker connects. Jacob brings AJ up to a vertical base. And AJ with the uppercut, big old uppercut to the jaw. Grabs Jacob, puts him in a side headlock. Innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. Delayed jackhammer. Adverse to taking action outside the ring. By no means is this your AJ drops one elbow to the top of the skull of Jacob. You still win this match. And drops elbow to the chest. Or submission. And another elbow to the chest. What a stop. Good grief. He might have oh, we're under a severe thunderstorm warning. Awesome. Jacob going for uh, the uh, submission done? on Jacob. Jacob fights out of it. His way free, but how much energy did he exhaust fighting his way out? Big old right knocks AJ all the way down to the ringside area. Jacob brings AJ up to a vertical base. 
Knife edge chop, and her knife edge chop. A third knife edge chop. A fourth, he's a fifth. He's really lining he's up the chest of AJ. Sure AJ's had enough grabs, Jacob. He's been gambling quite a bit here tonight. There's plenty of reward. European uppercut drops Jacob all the way down to the ground. AJ brings Jacob up to the Kicks him in the midsection, DDT plants him. European uppercut. Bring Jacob up to a vertical base. If you ask me, guys, and like drops him. No AJ lining You're Jacob up to put this one away. AJ KO out of nowhere. Jacob's busted open. AJ goes for his pin. The ref rushes over. Could it be over with? We got a one. We got a two. And J or AJ is your winner. Singles contest has a victor. Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. He really put on a great show. AJ loses the Intercontinental Championship, but he gains the, the King of Summer. Ladies and you know what time it is. If you are in 10, I have your character already, and you want to be for the JJ Broadcast Champion.